All right, more breaking news here at noon. The city of Cape Coral is now in the clear. City homeowners will retain their 25% flood insurance discount. Wink News reporter Amy Gallo joins us live now in Cape Coral from City Hall. Amy, this is welcome news, but Cape leaders have to meet some conditions. That's right. The city of Cape Coral is about to breathe a major sigh of relief, but there are still some things that it needs to do in order to keep that FEMA flood insurance uh, to, in, to into the future here. Representative Mike Giolombardo says the city of Cape Coral told him it is back at a 25% discount, meaning the FEMA flood insurance retrograde in Cape Coral just got pulled. According to Giolombardo, FEMA is now requiring Cape Coral to put a plan together to prevent this from happening again. You remember since March, homeowners in Cape Coral, Fort Myers Beach, Bonita's Springs, Estero, and unincorporated Lee County have been worried the discount would be gone for good. This after FEMA said there was unpermitted work and a lack of documentation of damages and required repairs after Hurricane Ian. Last week, FEMA was supposed to give their answer, but there was a delay. But with Cape Coral now in the clear, the question becomes what happens to those other three communities that were affected by this change? I am working to find that answer out for you, and as soon as we know more, we will update you. For now, live in Cape Coral, Amy Gallo, Wink News. All right, thank you very much. Well, for